hello friends welcome back to code tonight so in today's video we are focusing on how to solve error um, invalid token the audience empty is invalid so on um, what i am doing here is i have created uh, one api and this project is basically in dotnet core 7 okay so uh, in this uh, i am trying to use jwt token authentication and for that purpose i am calling uh, one api here which will provide the token and i am storing that token into the cookie and then uh, i am using that in the second api okay so when i am passing that in the second api uh, here you will see that uh, it is still showing that invalid token the audience empty is invalid now the api is also in core 7 okay so we will just see that so i am just uh, uh, creating a demo api and this is the one which i'm trying to hit and it has the authorized attribute here so that's why it is checking for jwt okay now we will go to program.cs because in dotnet core uh, 6 and 7 we have this program.cs file and uh, for using jwt token we have to add following details here so now if you are getting the error the uh, audience empty is invalid then what you have to do is you have to um, stop the program and then you see here in add authentication method here we have validate issuer true and validate audience true so you can put this validate audience to false okay now you can run the application again so basically validate audience will check for the audience now that is uh, you can set to false if you want to fix the error okay so we will again try one more time uh, to see if the api works this time so uh, this error basically you might find in dotnet core 6 and dotnet core 7 uh, so uh, you can have a look at this solution okay so first is we are calling the api to get the token and then okay and then we will call another method which will consume that uh, token okay so we will copy the action name from here and we will write that up okay so now you see that error has changed it is saying the issuer null is invalid so now uh, this is because there is another property uh, if you go there there is validate issuer so you can also set that to false okay so once you set that to false also then you will not see any error and this time uh, your api will work fine so uh, you can see this time it has reached to the api so now our ever error has been resolved so uh, this is how you can uh, fix the error uh, regarding the um, audience in the jwt token so thanks for watching guys and let us know if the issue remains and thank you